Hi all, long time no see. <laughs> Sorry about the delay in a new video. I moved. Um, I moved to Nevada. Um, so we, I lived in California my entire life and last Thursday, it's now Tuesday of the following week, last Thursday I moved to Nevada. Uh, a little bit outside of Las Vegas, not quite into Las Vegas, um, about an hour away. We went in there to Vegas last yesterday, yesterday, to uh, just check things out. It was pretty nice, I'm not going to lie. Um, so today I got to go to the DMV and get my picture taken for my brand new driver's license. This is the first time that I'm not going to have to, that I'm not going to have to lie about my weight on my driver's license. I'm pretty proud of my weight. I'm so excited. Um, and I want to look decent. So I figured I'd take you guys along, do a chatty get ready with me. And yeah, so I got my coffee. Um, got a new background. It is not finished yet. I, I'm sorry if you see anything gross back here, but uh, right now it's not finished. I promise that we're going to get a good background going. I'm actually, now that I'm set up in my, my permanent location, I'm going to get some lights, though right now I'm in front of two windows and the sun's pretty good, so hopefully the hopefully the lighting will be good in this video, but I'm definitely going to get some box lighting as well just to amp it up a little bit. But yeah, we're going to do a chat to get ready with me, so I'm going to get my makeup together, figure out what I want to do um, for, a, for a driver's license that who knows how long I'm going to have that, and we're going to get started. So. Okay, so I went ahead and primed my eyelids, set my eyelids, and then put down some tape because I want my, I want some sharp edges today. I want some clean edges today, basically. So what I decided I'm going to do today is go in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Soft Glam Palette. Um, and yeah, we're just going to create something simple and fun. I'm going to use this dusty rose color. Um... So I'm going to go in with my same brushes. Really, this isn't a tutorial. This is just going to be kind of, like I said, a chatty update on everything that happened the last few days. Almost, last, almost a week. <laughs> um, so yeah, we moved, I moved from California to Nevada. It has been an adventure. Um, now, where I lived in California, it wasn't that far it was about a four hour, it's about a four hour drive, but, um, I have, I had my cats with me who did not enjoy it. <laughs> they were in, well, Freya was in her little cage thing. It wasn't really a cage, it was like a carrier case. She was in that the entire time, though she tried to escape a few times. Loki managed to get out of his crate and ended up underneath the seat. But that's okay, because he, he didn't do anything weird. I have a Fiat, so it's tiny. So it's not like he could go anywhere or do anything. Um, he just he just sat under the seat the majority of the time. And when I got out of the car, he didn't even attempt to run. He was just like, um, I don't know what this is, and I don't like it. So um, my, my dogs rode in my dad's truck, and they loved that. <laughs> they loved that. Oh, my gosh. They loved the undivided attention from him. They loved being in the truck because they've only been ever been in small cars. Um, he didn't put them in the back of the truck because we had all our stuff in the back of the truck, but they loved it. Molly was having the best time. Like I said, I think I'm going to go in that dusty rose color today. Um, it's getting close to Valentine's Day around here. We'll go ahead and do a, like a pinky purpley... Eh, as much as we can with this palette. It's not really a pinky purpley palette. Um, but yeah, Molly loved it. Sophie, I guess, was just like... She wanted to be as close to my dad as possible. Because she gets nervous around... She gets nervous. She She is not calming down a lot around here yet. She... Last night she almost refused to come inside. Um, I had to get down on the ground and like beggar basically. Um, I'm always getting a little comfortable. Sophie, Sophie not so much. She's not really digging this moving thing. Um, yeah, she's not digging the moving thing. It's a lot of change. I mean, shoot, I don't blame her. It's a lot of change. My mom, she passed away in June, June 29th my mom passed away. And we started doing a lot of work on our old house 
and it, we changed it a lot. We got rid of a lot of stuff and changed it a lot. And we've had Sophie since she was three months old, so she's she's now seven, and she's just like, what? I don't. What are we? What are we doing? We didn't make any. We didn't make a lot of changes between then and you know, between then. Um, and yes, I lived with my, people are probably going to ask, I lived with my mother, uh, for a while, or for, I've lived with my mother my whole life, <laughs> I'm one, I, I'm kind of a loser in that respect, which, not really though, because my mom and I were partners, um, my parents got divorced when, my parents got divorced when I was 23, I think, 23, um, and I was about to go to college, but my mom, I'm like going off on a tangent here. I was talking about Sophie. Um, just know that Sophie isn't adjusting well. I'll keep you updated on Sophie. The cats are doing great. Um, but when I was 23, my dad, my parents divorced. And my dad moved here, actually, to Nevada. Um, and lived here for a while. And then they reconciled. Got remarried. But he... And when when I, when they divorced when I was 23, I was about to go to college, but we couldn't afford it with the divorce and everything. And my mom was like, "No, please stay here and help me," and you know, all that. So I did, and I was I, I got into a major depression. Um, because I couldn't go to you know I couldn't go on and live my life, which wasn't anybody's fault. It just it is what it is. It happened the way it happened. Um. Anyway. Fast forward, you know, my mom and I, we were, we were partners, we took care of the house together, we, we did everything, um, we pretty much did everything together, you know, we took care of the house and all of that. Then my parents reconciled and got remarried, but my dad was stuck in Nevada, so, they were being remarried, but he was stuck in Nevada for a long time, and he didn't come back until... Actually, February 2017? Yeah, 17. So, almost two years ago. And then my mom got sick. So, you know, when he moved back, I was like, okay, you know, he can take care of her. I can move on, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, that's, that's not what happened. Um, so, now we're here. So, you know, my mom got sick. She, she passed on. Um, so never really living anywhere else on my own. I just went ahead and moved with my dad here so that we could start over basically because, you know, lived in lived in the Antelope Valley, lived in California my whole life. Lived in that house for a long time, 22 years. And now we're here. And it, it's a good change. It's a good change. So I, I think it's something that I need is a nice change. Because this is getting everywhere. This is the rose pink color, and I'm just, I'm just putting it on willy nilly right now. Um, but it's a good change. I, I don't have any problems with the change. I mean, don't get me wrong. I cried. <laughs> I cried. I mourn the loss of our house. I mourn the fact that you know we weren't gonna live there anymore. But I'm also really excited about having changed for the first time in 22 years. Um, so yeah. So that's a little bit of a backstory on my life. So now I, I do live here with my father. Um, and it's the same thing where we're basically, we're going to take care of the house together and all of that. I went to, we went to Vegas yesterday and I went to the container store for the very first time. That's going to be a dangerous place. <laughs> I got a lot of stuff. Um, I'm still trying to get my kitchen in order. I got my, well, not really. I have like three or four boxes left that I need to do for my bedroom. I gotta get this room completely in order. I got my stuff in here. I just gotta, I just gotta put it, to, of course my vanity was like priority. <laughs> my bedroom, I have it set up the way I want. My bathroom, I have it set up the way I want. I just need to put some finishing decorating touches on it and put things, you know, put some last few things in its place. And then same thing in here. I have my vanity where I want it because again, priorities. Um, and then I'm just going to go and 
figure out when I want to go from there and find my mirrors, USB cord, and I don't know, go from there. Um, okay. So there's the eyes. See, I can do makeup quickly when I'm not talking about it. Uh, shoot. There, no, the, the eyes aren't done, obviously. The eyes need, oh, you know what? I forgot my outer corner. Okay, I'm not even distracted. I'm gonna go in um, with the color Sienna and mix it with the color Mulberry. Because again, I want to keep it kind of pinky purpley tones today. And uh, put that in my outer V. Um, yeah, so we went to Vegas yesterday. We, we found a Target, thank God. Found a Target. I'm going through withdrawals from Target. I haven't gone since last Wednesday and today's Tuesday. <laughs> I know. Don't make fun of me. Actually, you can make fun of me all you want, because that's, that's, that's silly, right? Like, really, Kristen? Really? Yes, really. I miss it. I miss it. Um, but, so we went to Target, and then we found, and he took me to this really cool, like, outdoor mall. And it has, has a Whole Foods, which I'm excited about. It has an Ulta. It has a container store, which... I'm telling you, I went crazy in the container store. Um, I'm crazy in the container store. And then it has a freestanding Mac and a freestanding Inglots. If you know anything about makeup, oh my gosh, I'm so excited about a freestanding Inglots. I mean, it's Vegas, so I figured I'd... I, I actually I didn't think about it, but I'm I, now that I think about it, I'm probably sure I can probably find one at the Strip, too, but... I don't have to go to the strip. I want to go and build myself a palette of Inglot, like single Inglot, Inglot shadows. Because their shadows are awesome and you can build your own and... Sorry. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Um... That's right, my driver's license is going to be a tad bit dramatic. Just like I want it to be. <laughs> uh, 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 I just want to look. No. My dad went to breakfast. There's this local place here um, that my dad loves. And I love it too. And I've been going with him every morning for the last few mornings. But today I decided to go ahead and film because I got up a little late. Decided I needed to film, get ready. You know, things like that. Uh, but, gosh. I can't even tell you how many times we've been there since we got here, so I don't feel too bad about it. <laughs> so before I do the rest of my eyes and then, or I'm sorry, take off the tape so I can do my face and then the rest of my eyes, I'm going to go in with this uh, Clinique Pretty Easy Eyeliner and do my eyeliner real quick while I have the tape down so that it'll give me a nice guide. Um, so yeah, it's going to be an interesting change. i got to find a new job. Um, I no longer work at the job I worked at in California. So I gotta find a new job. I gotta, I gotta concentrate on this real quick. Pretty sure I just screwed up the swing. What else is new? Let's tear it off and see. Oh no, that's fine. Oh no, that's fine. Okay. I just went a little crazy on the tape. Just why I put the tape down. This one's a little more dramatic than this wing. I'm not gonna try to fix it. <laughs> I had to take a break to go play with my dogs. Sophie was having fun at least, so. Maybe she's getting a little more comfortable. I think she just, she, all our toys are out on the patio out back. So I picked up a couple of her balls and was like, let's play. And she was having fun. So that's good. So today I'm going to use the Neutrogena Healthy Skin Liquid Makeup because I want something natural looking and something just, you know, a little glowy on the skin so that uh, it'll look good in pictures. Oh, but this has FBF, doesn't it? Ugh. 
flashback. You know what? I might powder it. I might go ahead and just powder it. Hopefully get some of that. Granted, it'll take out some of the dewiness, but that's okay because the Charlotte Tilbury powder is also gorgeous on the skin. And I don't want a bunch of flashback, so. I don't want them to look at my license and be like, damn, girl, you pale. Right. Anyway, so yeah, the cats. So the first couple days that we were here, the cats hid in like a million different places. <laughs> uh, actually, no, it's not true. They only hid in one place. Well, two places. Freya had two places to hide. Loki only had one place to hide. I have two cupboards underneath my sink in my bathroom, and he was just in one of the cupboards. And then he moved to, there's a, like a storage coverage, cup, cupboard, I'm saying coverage, cupboard <laughs> in there as well in the bathroom, and uh, eventually just moved over there. We're like, hmm, I just want to be, just want to be in one of these cupboards, Mom. Which is understandable. That's one of his favorite places to be when we were at the other house, too. He loved to be in the linen closet. He <coughs> loved it. So it made sense. Um, that's where he's comfortable. And then Freya, at first she was just in my closet. She was in one of my bags. She was like, okay, I'm ready to go home now. <laughs> and then after um, that she started hiding in the bathroom with her brother. She's, she was like, oh, this is a good spot. And she like started taking over the cupboards. So that's when Loki pretty much went into the linen or to the storage cupboard and they're like, she took my spot. <laughs> um, and then once I got my bed set up and made and everything, Freya started hiding in my bed, which was so cute. So I'd go in there and she'd be under my covers or behind my pillow, like, um, yeah. But now, they're cool. They, they love this house. They love exploring it. They love going in every room. They love all the windows. I don't feel like we had a lot of windows for them to, like, look out in the, in the last house. They were all covered by furniture or an awkward position. But here, like, my bed's against my window in my room. So they love that. Um, there's two windows right here. I love that. There's even windows in the bathrooms. Um, my bathroom has two windows and, yeah. And they're like, they're like big windows. They're not like the tiny bathroom windows. They're big windows and she likes those though. They like those too. And then there's two windows in the living Yeah, there's a lot of windows. Hmm. A lot of windows in this house. But the cool thing is, is that the house, the house faces north. So, like, the sun's right there. I don't know. It's like right there. And so it comes up. So that's east to west. So it's always on the back side of the house. So it never really gets that hot. And I don't feel like it gets that sunny. Of course, I say that hot. I don't know yet because it's February. We've been having unusually cold weather. It actually, it snowed here, not last night, but the night before, which is very rare in the Mojave Desert for us to get snow. Um, and then there's a, like a mountain pass between us and Vegas, and they got a lot of snow. It's been raining, it's been windy, it's been cold. It was 29 degrees this morning. Yeah, but... I feel like in the winter, or in the summer, excuse me, it's not going to be as bad because the sun is pretty much over there and the window covers, they all seem to cover it up and most of our living is done in the, in the other side of the house. So like my bedroom faces north. So I don't get like a lot of daily sun. This is when I'm getting the most sunlight here because the sun's just, you know, it's morning time, which is another reason why I'm going to get the box light. So. I think I've been doing my face forever. Speaking of Loki and Freya, <laughs> they're both sitting on my vanity right now. They crack me up. 
Yeah, in order to hopefully prevent the flashback of the SPF that I felt it was on my face and in real life, I'm gonna go in with my Charlotte Tilbury. Oh wait, hold on. I'm gonna do my I'm gonna do my concealer. Ta. Um, so between the last time we talked and this time, I made a four order because I had a um I had a coupon. Oh no, I'm sorry. This four order that's coming tomorrow was the one that I had a coupon for. Right before I left, that's right, I made a four order because I have no chill. I have no chill. So before I left California, I made a Sephora order and I got <laughs> I got the Jouer um, concealer. When I was looking back on the footage of using the sample, I was amazed at how much on camera it it like smoothed my under eyes and how much it made it just flawless. Um, it's not quite as flawless in real life, but it's pretty good. I feel like now that I have wheat as a whole, like a whole um, thing, I don't think that this is going to be really my color right now. I think in the summer it'll be fine, like when it starts getting warmer and I start getting a little more color. But I think this one just was a, I should have went down one shade. But that's okay because it still works and it still covers really nicely. And you don't need a lot at all. So, see, in real life I can still see a little darkness, but I, I, all of them, even my favorite Laura Mercy, I can still see a little darkness. I'm not going to put a lot down there because I don't want to look overly made up in this picture. Yeah, I don't want to look overly made up. Mm. I'm a dork. Um, I, I don't want to have a heavy under eye in this picture for the DMV. So I'm just going to go ahead with my Charlotte Tilbury and just cut up pat that on. And I think that this combination, just like my Laura Mercier and this Charlotte Tilbury powder, beautiful combination, beautiful. Okay. I've been trying to sample the Laura Mercier foundation okay I'm kind of glad I didn't get a whole bottle of it I feel like it kind of emphasizes some texture or not some texture like my wrinkles it's okay I think I'm gonna try the Dior um, I don't even remember what it's called I'll put it on the screen or down below I'm gonna try to I'm gonna try the Dior one I've heard really good things about that one on dry skin like I have so I'm gonna try that instead I did not put on my Tatcha Cream Silk Primer, your canvas. Oh well. Okay. Um, I've been enjoying that as well. I like that one, but not an essential step. But I like it. Oh, I put away the powder. I said I wanted to powder my face. <sighs> Scatterbrained as usual. Some things never change. We have crappy internet. Well, okay, right now we have only have a Verizon hotspot because we live in a tiny little town. Not really tiny, really not tiny, but we live in a town instead of like Vegas and they don't offer a lot of internet choices. So we're getting our internet in a month. So I'm, I'm, I'm hoping to God they put that in there because um, I guess these poor people got, a lot of them got laid off, so I'm hoping that they did it correctly. I'm, I actually need to talk to my dad and we need to call and make sure that they, they put the internet in because it, it's like a month waiting list. I'm like, really? A month? That's crazy. We can't even get the really high speed one. It has to be broadband. And I'm like, so I'm hoping that I can get this video up tonight. Uh, on my hotspot. I hope it doesn't take up too much data. I may have to go to like McDonald's or something, find a free Wi-Fi spot and do it there. Waiter. Let's see. Okay. 
So I'm going to go in with Dusty Rose instead on this pencil brush. Run it underneath the lower lash line. And then I'm going to go in with this brush here, this Morphe brush, and then I'm going to go in with Sienna and Mulberry mixed together. And I'm going to make that my, like, press it up. I need a mirror. I'm going to press it up right against my lower lash line. Try not to get up frame while I do this. Uh-oh, Fallout City. That's all right. I'll get it in a minute. Uh, yeah. All right. Didn't do a very good job with that. Oh well. It's only going to be immortalized forever in the DMD foil. Forever. If anybody is a Sandlot fan. Alright, so the next thing I'm going to do with my face, I'm going to go in with my better bronzer. Down all over. Well, not all over, but you know what I mean. Bronze. A little bit. <clears throat> then I'm going to go in with my Buxom. Oh, the lighting's changing. I'm going to go in with my Buxom Dolly blush. In that order I got with that Jouer, I actually went in and got seashells. Uh, sorry about the shadows. I got seashells, which looks like this. It's a pretty bronzy blush, but with this one, I think that I need to do more of the mauve color for obvious reasons. Got mauve tones, mauve pinky tones on the eyes. Do mauve pinky tones on the cheeks. So, um, and then I'm going to do I'm just going to do Moonstone Becca Moonstone on the the lighting is driving me nuts I'll figure out the lighting that's why I want to get those uh, box lights or the ring light one or the other I'm not really sure which yet Still got to do a little research and box lights are cheaper so I might start with that and just see what happens. Why did I put on my chin? That was weird. Yeah, yeah. We also got to the library and I thought there was one other thing. Oh, we were going to go to the post office but we actually just put that in the mail so no big deal. Um, yeah, okay. So then I just need to do my eyebrows. And I want to kind of do this quickly. So I think I'm just going to take my brow power today. I've been really enjoying the um, Urban Decay brow blade that I got. Don't get me wrong, but this is so quick and easy. That one's like really precise and really like almost dramatic looking and this one's just more quick and easy and because it covers more surface area being a little bit bigger. So, yeah. Okay, so there is the eyebrows. Now I'm going to go ahead and curl my lashes. <laughs> yeah, so all my makeup came with me so nothing broke, thank God. But again, I'm missing... But I have so many boxes to go through. We'll figure it out. Um, they don't have a Target here. But they do have a Walmart. And when I went to Walmart. Oh yeah the shadows are crazy. The lighting's crazy now. Um, when I went to Walmart. I went and got a new Flash Paradise. So. The. What is it called? The ColourPop BFF Mascara. It like. It did something that I've never seen a mascara do. It like faded off my eyelashes. 
Like they would look good and you would definitely see it, but then it would it wouldn't flake. But it almost disappear off my eyelashes like or maybe the maybe the correct term is it my lashes would fall yeah that's probably more like accurate what happened so like my my eyelashes stay curled pretty well but oh, my cats there are two ways into my room the other way is open and yet um but yeah my my lashes fell and they just looked lifeless by about five hours in and I was like I've never had a mascara like that ever my eyelashes stay curled really well usually so I just went back to this Maybelline or not this Maybelline this L'Oreal Lash Paradise because I really like this one but unfortunately I accidentally got the waterproof kind but I find it's not actually too bad to take off so it's okay I think I'm gonna do a skincare, not a skincare, but like a my skin routine, my skincare routine. Now that I have a big bathroom, a bigger bathroom, I think I'm gonna film that too. Thumbs up if you want to see that. My hair is crazy. I'm just gonna brush it and bring it down. Ooh! Oh. I have another thing I want to talk to you guys about later, too. A sample I got from Sephora that is just like awesome. Um, yeah. It's a hair thing, which you guys know I don't care about my hair, so. But I'm pretty excited about it. I do want to talk about that in a video, too. Lips. I'm like, am I done? Am I ever done? always forget my dang lips. Always. Oh, I didn't put any eyeliner. I'm going to put my nude eyeliner on today. Inner, why, why do I always forget the inner corner highlight? Like, what is that? Speaking of looking awake and fresh, I'm going to go in with a mixture of glistening and fairy. I like mixing the two colors together. Fairy's more gold and glistening's more like champagne-y. More champagne-y, but together they're gorgeous. Like I said, I'm so sorry about the lighting. <sighs> the, the sun's moving, so, you yeah. mm, know. Hopefully it's not too bad. Okay. Lips. I'm going to line with this NYX in Dainty Days. Oh, am I doing that right? Dainty Days. I'm gonna go in with a nude. I'm gonna go in with Ariel from ColourPop. Okay, so now that we're we're settled in and everything. I'm going to start getting a consistent schedule on uploading. I'm thinking it's going to be, I think it's going to be um, Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. I'm um, not sure yet though. And I'll, I'll keep you updated on what it's going to be. But otherwise, yeah, now that we're back, I can start our back. Now that we're settled, we can go ahead and upload consistently. But yeah, thank you for doing this chat to get ready with me. I'm going to go 
get a new driver's license uh, for the state I'm in now and run a few errands and go see my grandma and yeah uh, thank you for for sitting with me I hope you enjoyed it please like and subscribe and I'll see you in my next one bye